What's going on, Raps fans? Matt Tierney here at Raptors.com. Uh, myself and Akil Augustine here, uh, we're rocking the Canada jersey uh, after a big win for the under-19s and also a big win for the Toronto Raptors, 97-72, uh, to 72, making light work of the Minnesota Timberwolves. Uh, what happened in that game, Akil? Well, first off, um, I spoke to Patrick Mutombo said the game started 0-0. But this Raptors Summer League team has come together quickly, and I think they have the luxury of familiarity. You see Pascal Siakam and Jakob Pertl out there, and for me personally, they were head and shoulders above the talent that Minnesota put on the floor. Of course, Minnesota, a different situation, giving away a lot of their draft picks for quality players to help them in the regular season. So I think there was a big difference in the skill set of the Minnesota players, and also the amount of familiarity that these Raptors guys have with Fred Van Vliet running the point, and with some usual faces, and a familiar coaching staff gives them a leg up. But they performed well, they did their job, yeah. and they stayed focused, they did the little things, and that's going to keep this coaching staff happy as they continue to progress through 2-0, hoping to continue their great run in the round-robin portion of Summer League. And also, all 13 players to get on the court score today, and another good performance by Kennedy Meeks off the bench. Yeah, it's important for them to get everybody who came out a look, and Kennedy Meeks has been progressing, surely. Um, he had a little trouble finishing in the first game, but he finished with some good numbers, and now you're starting to see him get acclimated to the NBA game, and that's always the biggest transition for big guys, because... They're disappearing quickly, and to be a modern NBA big, you've got to find some real quality ways to contribute, and I think Kennedy's going to find that. He's just got to acclimate himself to how this game is played at this level. Okay, okay, that'll do it here from Thomas and Max Center. The Raptors have an off day Sunday where they'll do an intra-squad scrimmage and be wrapping up the group stage trying to go 3-0 Monday at 8 p.m. Eastern, live on NBA TV Canada. Signing off from Las Vegas.